there is a petition right now. And the mayor has a few minutes to put it on the agenda. We've been calling him and asking him to put this item on the agenda. We want to have the city manager, we're gonna ask for his resignation. Now we wanna ask for his resignation and I think we've proven time and time again how the negligence on his part caused so much damage to so many people. When you have 24 inches of silt sitting on a pipe, those are 24 inches that are not gonna be flooding your home. 24 inches of water from sewer systems that are not gonna be infecting your bedrooms, your children's lives. Those are 24 inches that could have stayed in the drainage system instead of in your houses, instead of in your grandparents' homes, instead of in your parents' homes. Listen, this is, uh, this is really tough. Now, Randy Hall's asking, what's this? I'm applying for manager's job. No, no, Randy, I got my own profession. I, I am far away from a city manager. But I am uh, knowledgeable enough, as you are too, Randy, that it starts at the top. And when you have a manager that drops the ball like this, and I have a question. Did he know about this agreement on the is district drainage number nine or not? And uh, if he did, well, why didn't you do something about it? And if he didn't know, then case closed. You have somebody who's not doing what they're supposed to in reference. All these commissioners that were here, they ran on drainage. You would think that the commission would push the city manager to do something about drainage, something as basic as cleaning the pipes. Now, the city, come on, Mayor, Mayor Suarez, you're there. I asked the commission last time to have the courage to put the city manager up for a vote. It takes two commissioners to put him for a vote and it only takes the mayor to put him on the agenda. Now, it's been on executive session for a long time. In your website, it states that you are determined to give absolute transparency. Those are the words that are on the website, absolute transparency to the citizens of Westlaco. Absolute transparency means you're gonna put him on the agenda. You have a minute left. You're gonna put him on the agenda. Now, the city's watching. You don't do this. They're coming after you. Because it's up to you, Mayor. You can put him on the agenda right now. Call your city secretary. Tell her to put the city manager on the agenda. We want results. Enough time has passed already. If you think people are gonna forget about their sheetrock on their walls, about their belongings, about their baby pictures, about pictures that cannot be replaced. There's many things that people lost that cannot be replaced. If you think that time is going by and they're gonna forget about this, you are wrong. And I am here to remind them. Because if we don't do something about this now, we're gonna flood again. So my question is, city mayor, do you have the courage? Do you have the courage to put the city manager on the agenda? It's not hard.